Go ahead, step out of the vehicle, man. Step out of the vehicle. Well, here we go. Get in the car! Heads up! Every day is different. You can't uh, anticipate what's going to happen. So I think the variety, the difference in calls, and the fact that uh, I don't know what to expect is uh, the thing that keeps uh, keeps me interested, keeps me on my toes. It takes a certain sense of physical and mental toughness to do this job. I, I tell every young police officer that comes through here, we don't hire quitters. Quitters uh, get people hurt. They get themselves hurt, they get the fellow officers hurt, and you get the citizens hurt. Shoes on the passenger side behind the white van. Rotate, tell them. Bang, 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 bang. Miles Oliva, put your hands up. If we don't have the bad guy isolated, he can come up behind us. Do you think there's a better way it could be done? It was good going in until you got up in there and then... A person to do this job and be successful and who as a department we look for is somebody with good leadership skills, um, somebody that has patience and understanding and has a willingness to learn. Yeah. You guys found me eventually, correct? I knew yeah. where I was. Yeah. I also appreciate the training that we receive that allows you to kind of develop uh, special skill sets based on your interests. If you want to be a canine officer, a detective, crime scene investigator, uh, there's numerous opportunities to go throughout the department and that training is offered to help you with that specialized activity. I just want to make sure that you're, like I said, legit to go. Okay, you don't have a driver's license? I consider us to be a proactive department. But if you're going to sit here and bold face lie to me and insult my intelligence, then we're just going to go ahead and file charges on you. Everybody that works here knows that we're very aggressive when it comes to uh, solving problems within the community. So everybody's gone. Is there going to be any problems if we leave? I like the fact that uh, we're encouraged to get out there and, and get after the bad guys. Across the United States right now, there's a lot of problems going on with uh, the police. Here at Carrollton, we're not experiencing those problems because they support us, we go out and do our jobs, we embrace the community. Our community involvement uh, spreads all throughout many different directions, whether it's uh, citywide functions, uh, intimate functions with, with our citizens to help understand the problems that they have, but then also making sure that they understand what's made available through the city and through their police department. We are in the process of making the final plans for our new building. It should be opening in about two years. Um, it's going to offer a lot more space for our investigators. Sergeants are going to have a bigger area and the officers are going to have more space. We're looking for the best officers that we can find to fill this department. The department is full of very professional, uh, sharp, hardworking people that go out and demonstrate every day uh, their commitment to the community. We have a, a good chief who's progressive, who wants to move the uh, police department into a new age of policing. The idea of serving my community is something that has always been uh, in the core uh, of, of me and who I am. If you join Carrollton Police Department, you get to be a Carrollton police officer, and not everybody can say that.